Now, there are a number of places of execution in Edinburgh. Uh, William Burke, when he was convicted, William Hare, by the way, got off because he gave King's evidence against Burke, and so the deal was that he, he wasn't uh, prosecuted, so he was able to escape. Um, but William Burke was hung and anatomized <laughs> at the university, and his skeleton is now in the University Anatomy Museum. Um, and he was executed uh, up where we've just come from, on Castle Esplanade, presumably a very, very public place. You know, they wanted it to be, you know, sort of so everybody could witness this uh, event, you know. Um, people who were uh, executed for religious crimes like blasphemy or heresy or witchcraft uh, were hung in a place called Shrubs Hill, which is halfway down um, Leith Walk now, you know, so the main road that goes from the end of Princess Street down to Leith. Uh, halfway down there, there's a place called Shrub Hill, and that's where they would execute these uh, witches and so on. Uh, oh, and uh, also outside St. Giles Cathedral, uh, they sometimes executed people there again, if it was a very public case, and they thought there'd be a big crowd of people there, you know, uh, as in the case of William, William Burke. In fact, I don't know why they didn't do William Burke outside St. Giles, for some reason they did him on Castle Esplanade. Anyway.